Hello viewers, this is Wagada Ronald taking you through this tutorial on how to obtain other roots of aquatic equations given one complex root. So aquatic equation is one whose highest degree is degree 4. So in, this, in solving such problems, we have to recall that if one of the root is a complex number, then its conjugate is also a root. So in this case, we are given one root as the one root for this quartic equation and they want us to show that it's a root and to also find the other roots. So in this case we shall first let the equation to be equal to fz. After that we shall know that for this to be a root then its conjugate this must also be a root. So we are going to first get a correct equation for these two roots. So sum of roots will be this plus that to give you 6 and product of roots will be that times that. These are com complex and it's conjugate. So you'll come up with 3 squared plus 4 squared which is sorry, 3 squared plus 2 squared which is 9 plus 4 to give you 13. So the, co the equation having those two roots is z squared minus 6z plus 13 equal to 0. So the other roots will be got by dividing, you'll say this divided by that, and that is easily done by long division. So this is the equation given, and this will be now our divisor. So you get this highest power divided by this to get z squared, z squared multiply through this to get this. When you subtract, you come up with this, subtract this and this is zero, this and this is that, this and this is this, this and zero is that, this and zero is that. So get again the highest power, do the same, get the highest power divided by this to get negative 2z. So negative 2z multiply thought by this, you come up with this. So when you subtract, you come up with this. So you get this highest power divided by this, highest power to get 2. So 2 multiply thought by this, you come up with this. When you subtract, you get 0. Meaning, now since 0, since the remainder is 0, it implies that this is a root is a factor for the given aquatic equation. So you come up and say, since there is no remainder, then two plus sorry three plus two i is a root of the given equation. Now we have to again get other equations, other roots. So from this we shall know that this can be replaced by a product of two quadratic equations, this and this, the divisor and this so which is that now we, are, we already got the roots for this now we have to get the roots for this equ quadratic equation so for that we shall come up with a bold quadratic formula and substituting the quadratic formula as we did in the previous lessons we shall come up with that now this negative 4i is the same as 2i so 2 can be divided to get 1 plus or minus i so those are the three other roots. One root is a conjugate, which is 3 minus 2i. Then the third root is 1 plus i. And the fourth root is 1 minus i. So that was the solution for, to problem 1. Now we shall go to problem 2. If 3 minus 2i and 1 plus i are roots of the equation az square, az to power 4 plus bz cubed plus cz squared plus dz plus e equal to 0. Find the values of a, b, c, d, and e. So in that case, we shall first let the fz to be equal to the given quartic equation. And since this is a root, then it means that this conjugate is also a root. Do they get the quadratic formula like we have done in, the pre in problem 1 to get that? Similarly, if this is a root, then its conjugate is also a root. So do the same, get the sum of roots, product of roots, get the quadratic equation. After that, we shall say that this times so this times this will give you the quartic equation which was given. So multiply the two, expand to get that. So expansion, this z squared is multiplied through by this, through this, to get that. Then negative 6z is multiplied through by this to get that. And 13 is multiplied through by this to get that. 
after that we collect like terms to come up with this then we shall compare with our given equation when you compare you shall know that a is equal to 1 which is that and b is equal to negative 8 which is that mm -hmm. c is 27 d is negative 38 which is that and e is 26 so that brings us to the end of our lesson thank you for watching and please subscribe to my channel rower e-learning platform